guys and today I am going over the Red Poison theme maker which is set to release today so let's get started essentially the Red Poison theme maker is a one step download application meaning you don't have to install anything right when you download it you can just double click it and open it right up now once you open the Red Poison theme maker you'll be presented with many options one you can have the option of making a theme two you can upload it to the store three you can access to make a theme or convert it and then you can, can you can theme the control center um that'll go with CCC controls so let's get started with what the main thing of this was created for the main thing it was created for is the theme maker so if you click theme maker it gives you the option to choose a theme name so for this I'm gonna choose um, I full color and here's the initial theme maker now what it consists of is it shows the icon of what it originally is and it gives the name and when you select the image that will change to image selected so I'm going to go ahead and define an image for phone so I'm going to do this one and as you can see it says successfully found image it gives the image location and it displays the image right there so if I would do that for all of them and click finalize they need to be 120 by 120 it's going to tell you that if they are not you can click no and then go back and edit it to make it 120 by 120 so I'm going to go ahead and click finalize I'm going to click yes and then you'll you'll be greeted with this nice screen saying building your wonderful theme and when that is complete it's going to say done and what that essentially did was create a folder on our desktop named theme maker and when you open that folder I full color was created now dot theme do not remove that or winter board won't recognize it so just remember don't delete that so if you go into it it'll have a bundles and then we'll have the mobile phone which is the one we just defined right here so it created two icons for us and it also did it for mobile SMS so that will help in the theme making so now that we did that I'm going to show you where to place this folder so if you open up WinSCP and then enter your IP 192.168.0.13 and root and alpine your IP can be found in settings and once it goes through you can go to all the way up to the main folder go to library themes and then navigate here to your desktop and then theme maker and I full color I'm gonna drag it there and now I'm gonna show you my phone okay now that we're on my phone I'm gonna go to the winterboard application now keep in mind today winterboard was updated by Saruk to the iOS 7 version so it doesn't look like iOS 6 anymore so here it is so I'm gonna select themes and as you can see I full color is there now when I'm gonna respring I'm gonna wait for it to load this is connected via USB so it's going to reconnect right when it resprings so now it's showing an Apple logo on my phone and it's showing there too and as you can see if I unlock my phone 
the phone and messages app is now themed. That was made very easy with that. The wallpaper is also very themable. You can watch another video on that. That's going to come out soon. If not, by the time you're watching this video, it'll probably already be out. And there will be a way to define the wallpaper. It won't be able to be set with Winterboard, but there is a special way of setting it. And you can use that with Cydia so that your wallpaper will be installed when the theme is installed. So you can also, with uh, Red Poison Theme Maker, you can also submit it to the theme store. So if I go back here, it's going to tell you your work will not be saved. So I'm click yes. And I'm going to upload to theme store. When clicking that, it's going to open up a little web browser that goes to a website that we have with a form on it. And this form will allow you to tell you everything you need to know. You're going to need to zip it up. So by zipping, we mean going here. And then, so I full color, we right click. And we can, hold on, I'm looking at it. Um, I don't have Win at, Win, uh, WinRAR right here. But if you, let me see, right here. If you send to compress zip, it'll zip it for you right there. And then you can simply upload that to Mediafire. And then you can put the Mediafire link right here. So once you do that, you have to fill out all of this. You can click submit and it will be sent to us to review. And once we successfully review it, it will be uploaded to the theme store. Now the CC control steamer is for the control center, of course. And as you can see, mine is themed, but that is a default theme that comes with CC controls. So what theme maker will allow you to do is change these to ones that you want and you can make your own and even upload them to Cydia or the theme store or whatever you want. So that is pretty much the end of our review for the Red Poison Theme Maker. I hope you will enjoy using it. Um, I very recommend you donate to us. We spend a lot of time working on this. All of our developers work really hard and it's very nice to know that we achieve something like this. So thank you for watching and I hope you enjoy. Have a good evening.